This is Al McGee with YETicket.com. I'm going to talk about this new documentary. It's about Malcolm X and Muhammad Ali. It's called Blood Brothers, Malcolm X and Muhammad Ali. It's going to be on Netflix on September the 9th. Make sure you put it in your calendar to watch it on September the 9th. Well, anyway, this is about, well, two of the most iconic figures of the 20th century. This is about Muhammad Ali, which I really love, and Malcolm X, who I really admired. Now, you got to understand these guys, who they were at the time. They were very powerful in the 60s at the time. Now, their relationship, according to the documentary, only lasted about two to three years. And you will see some of the people that helped to deteriorate their relationship. Because remember, Malcolm X was teaching Cassius Clay at the time about the nation of Islam. And then, you know, much later, Muhammad Ali joined the nation and the great uh, honorable Elijah Muhammad gave it his, his name. And so this documentary is really great to watch. Now you're going to see some people being interviewed in this uh, documentary, for example, you know, you're going to see uh, a guy who was with the Nation of Islam at that time. And he's going to tell you some things about it. But also here in, the, here in this documentary, too, you're going to see Malcolm X's daughter being interviewed, two of Muhammad Ali's uh, daughters being interviewed, also Al Sharpton and Cornell West. Now, Cornell West and Al Sharpton really wasn't around these people at that time, especially Al Sharpton. He was around James Brown not around Muhammad Ali and Malcolm X. But anyway, I feel that there was, could have been other people they could interview, but one of the most important person that they did interview was Muhammad Ali's brother, Rotman, Rotman Ali. That, and that's his only brother too. And he was there thick and thin with his brother. And he really told a lot of things about what happened you know, from the questions that they ask for the documentary. But also, I feel that one person they should have asked uh, was uh, uh, Khalil Ali, but they married in 1967, and this is after the death of Malcolm X. Man, she was 17. She was Belinda Boyd at the time, but she was in the Nation of Islam, and her parents were very close to the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. So, as she was growing up, she heard and she knew she probably met uh, Malcolm X and things like that. And she met Muhammad Ali when she was a very young girl also. So she could have said a lot about their relationship too. Not only that, this shows and the documentary points to it, how Muhammad Ali was a totally different person with the teachings of the Honorable Elijah Muhammad. Man, Wait till you see this scene with uh, Muhammad Ali and the television host, Gore Vidal. Not only that, in this documentary, you learn about their falling out, why they fell out, and, and what happened between the two of them. And not only that, you'll find out what happened to Malcolm X. You, if you know history, you should know what happened. But you will see a different Ali at that time when he became a member of the Nation of Islam and his speaking and his teachings and what he said to people when he met them, when he was uh, first in the Nation of Islam. Blood Brothers, Malcolm X and Muhammad Ali. This is a very good documentary. I'm going to give it three palm trees out of four. The reason for that, I feel they didn't interview enough people. But the research is good in this documentary. It really is. And it's based on a book also. It's based on the book of uh, Blood Brothers, written by Randy Roberts and uh, Johnny Smith. So, you know, they have some good research on it. And they have some good footage in this documentary. But I still feel that they needed a few more witnesses to talk about what really actually happened. But I really enjoyed it, and you will too. Hey, thanks for watching my 
review of Blood Brothers. Malcolm X and Muhammad Ali will be on Netflix September the 9th. On Netflix on September the 9th. Thanks for watching. I really This is your entertainment ticket. Latest and greatest movie review.